Nina have just walked out onto court for the final of the WTA Internazionale BNL d'Italia in Rome. The Foro Italico in all its uh, updated glory for the 40th year. And what a mouth-watering final we have. Sharapova, the defending champion in Rome, against, of course, the current French Open champion. The champion in the commentary box, too, in the form of Joe Jury, former French semi-finalist and world number five. And uh, Serena, it was a shame she pulled out yesterday, but if she's got a bit of a niggle, then it's probably the final that uh, is best suited. Oh, very much, yes. Uh, I think she's just, you're all ready to go, and it's on the actual morning, and, you know, you've had your practice, you're waiting for the match, and then suddenly there's no match, so there's a lot of emotional sort of spillage over So I expect she went and practiced again. Mm. She's got that out of the system, but sometimes it's nice to have a day off. Five years younger at 25. It's her fifth final this year, of course. She was final at Wimbledon last year. Final again at the Australian Open. So she's knocking on another major door, no doubt about that. And she's making it through to finals of the biggest tournaments this year. So she really is back to somewhere near her very, very best. Yes, yeah, she is. Oh, she's a classy player and person because she's so professional. Got all the money in the world that she would ever want. She's going to get married in November. She's very happy about that. She wants to be out here on a court performing. That's what drives her. What you made of her route through? I mean, the Venus Williams match was very impressive, mm. wasn't it? Yeah, just tightened up, but played very consistently in, in the phases that she had to. Actually, Williams against Williams and Kerber, because that got a little bit sticky as well, didn't it? Yeah, it did. And Kerber, top ten next week. Terrific for her. She's going to be number four in the world this year come Monday, Kerber. One to look out for as an outsider for the French. Which hero comedians <laughs> always used to say. Yes. <laughs> And of course, Thomas Hogstead in the corner for Sharapova since uh, the start of 2011. Yeah. Terrific job he's done. He so builds her up and sort of knocks the opponents down when he comes on for his courtside oh, chats, doesn't he? And chose to receive. Lately, with the, the confidence, especially the second serve. A few more double faults, I, I, I think, this week than she has. You know, eight double faults, one match, six in another. But, you know, She's keeping it to that. It used to be double, didn't it, when it was Absolutely. going badly. Yeah. But now it's, it's pretty good and consistent now. Go on, Chris. Ace double fault. <laughs> <laughs> it's uncanny, isn't it? A little mental switch. <laughs> Super crowds all week. It's a combined event, of course, now. With the men. Sharp over two, three. Second double. I thought that last rally in particular was very telling, Chris. You've been going on, on about uh, Sharapova's forehand. Lee was trying to break it down. She got the mistake in the end. Yeah. Sharapova's going nowhere. She's played the best tennis, I think, since last year at Roland Garros to go four love up. And then she kind of blinked and thought, oh, I'm playing really well. And then you sort of get a little bit lost in the situation. She wants it to be over. And some frantic looks again at her husband. So how is she going to handle herself? He was reading of the riot act. 
Now in 24 minutes, Sharapova back in this final. Set three, four down from a. Self-imposed when you're cruising in a match. Would he love to break point? Not long ago, we were just talking about how consistent and solid she was. She keeps this up. She's going to win this pretty easy. But her reputation goes before, isn't it? Because it's so easy from here. It's so easy to know what you should be doing, what yeah. you should be thinking. Corner, a nice open space. secure and it went to a breaker they had to leave the court because it was mm. totally unplayable yeah. and just can you believe it started to rain again yeah. I've mean, been faffing about for a while I thought they would have saved a championship point well over two hours ago Sharapova now she has one of her own that's it she's wide Sharapova has won it. She has success. Yes, yes. it is. Oh, my. <laughs> well, that's good to see. Very good spirits from the two of them. What more can you do on a horrible day like this? Well, well done to the pair of them. Someone had to win it in the end. Delight for Sharapova. It was a huge win for her here last year on the clay, and she's repeated. It'll feel mighty, mighty good.